Colleen Murphy, thanks for taking the time. And uh, great event for you last weekend. Went up to Wyoming and really swam well. Yeah, the girls knew that they wanted to go in there and dominate and try to win that meet. It's been a long time since we beat Wyoming, so it was a great win for the ladies to to come home with a W. It came down to the last two events, and they shone through. Corbin Cormack won the 200 IM, and what was even you know nicer is that Hanani Dona ended up being third. So lots of points right there, um, so that it didn't even matter what happened in the last relay. We had already won the event, so that was a lot of fun. Yeah, that's that's a, that's great, and it seems like you're getting more and more swimmers involved, more and more depth on this team. Yeah, the depth really shown through here. Um, you know, Corbin Cormack and Abby Turner each won two events, but then Alex Clark, Corinne, Kai Min, uh, they all got wins, um, and so that was really nice for them. Kai Min's a freshman, um, so that was really nice. Uh, Alex Clark's win in the Twitter fly, she came from behind to touch people out, and then actually we went one, two, three in that event. They all came from behind. Actually, the two Wyoming swimmers were ahead. And on the last 50, all three of them pulled it through to go one, two, three. So that was a lot of fun. Uh, Corinne and Kaiman have been dominating the backstrokes all year. So that's been fun as well. They like to go one, two. Kaiman's a little more of a sprinter. Corinne's a little more of a tuner backstroker. So that's been fun. Yeah, I, obviously, um, you said it's been a long time since you beat Wyoming. So what's the mood of the team now? You, you head to Grand Canyon this, this weekend for another duel. But uh, what's the mood of the team? I think we have a lot of confidence right now. I think having a big win like that, really kind of even steps up our level of training because people have a lot of confidence in what they're doing. We talked about it yesterday. We talked about things that we can improve on and things that went really well uh, against Wyoming. And so we'll continue to build on that at Grand Canyon this weekend. It's very nice to be at sea level. So the girls are very excited about that and to be able to breathe lots of oxygen, especially in those distance events. So they're excited. It's out in the sun. It's an outdoor pool. Hopefully we don't get too sunburned out in Phoenix, but it's going to be a great weekend. Should be. Also, one more thing. Mountain West, did you, like, make a noise? Are people around the Mountain West going to go, wait a minute, Air Force beat Wyoming? I actually got a text from a fellow Mountain West coach, not the Wyoming coach, on the way home from that meet. So I think other coaches noticed that, you know, that was a big win for us and congratulated our team for that. We also had lots of alumni that reached out to me because – you know, I've been here 11 years and we've never beaten Wyoming until this year. And so those alumni that I've been, you know, part of, they all reached out. Some of them, you know, reposted it on their Instagram, that kind of stuff. So it's always been a big rivalry for our men's team. Um, and on the women's side, I think it's a big rivalry as well. So it was nice to come home with that win. Fantastic. Colleen Murphy, thanks for the time. Good luck this weekend. Thank you.